arrived on the music scene just over a decade ago, it signaled something very special. Jazz had a major new artist. Well, with comparisons to Nat King Cole and Marvin Gaye, there was no question that Gregory Porter was going to be a success, a big success. And what a success he is. Following the release of his latest album, Still Rising, the Grammy award-winning artist is here with us now. He's going to sing for us in a moment. Oh. He was rehearsing in the break. It sounds incredible. <laughs> How lovely to see you. Thank you for joining us. Wonderful to be with you both. Thank you. So you were, before all of this, you could have been a chef. Yes, <laughs> yes, that was uh, still my love. I still can be. This thing ain't over with. <laughs> you, <know? laughs> you could, you could, <laughs> at some stage in the future, be in our kitchen. Right, oh, exactly. What's exactly. your signature dish? What do you, you, cook? you know, my, my, my friends love my uh, curry rubbed salmon with a mango chutney. That's something I enjoy doing and eating. So. <laughs> I literally can't believe that we have pictures to cover this. Right, right. Look at this. You do do it properly. Yeah, that's me and my son, and uh, we, we, we enjoy cooking in the kitchen. We having fun. It's, you know, I, I do things for fun. I do music for fun and, and cooking for fun, yeah. yeah. You are so lovely. I, I watched you on Jules Holland years ago, and, yeah. and, and you made you give me goosebumps. And to hear you in the studio then, mm. what a treat we've got! Yeah. What uh, Gregory Porter. Oh, thank so, you. So, tell us about the new album. The new album is a collection of songs. Some of them previously released. There's new songs. There's duets that I've been doing over the years that people may not be uh, aware of. Musical greats: uh, Ella Fitzgerald, Nat King Cole, Buddy wow. Holly. Uh, extraordinary. And, and UK artist, Jimmy Cullum, uh, Paloma Faith. Have you ever worked with Noel Rogers? I have not. We keep talking. I'd love to see that. We keep meeting each other in the airport. Hey, brother, hey. Oh, yes. <laughs> but we haven't, that hadn't happened yet. I'd love to see that. Yeah, me too. Thank yeah. You. <laughs> get, get, get the word out. All right. Yeah. Do, you, um, do you think that uh, people who maybe not, not sort of didn't listen to music very much yeah. or fell out of love with music drifted in a big way back to music during the pandemic? Yes, absolutely. I think uh, music, uh, for and myself included, lifted a lot of people's spirits in a time of, uh, you know, great difficulty. I lost my brother during the pandemic, and I had to go back to music, music that he gave me, uh, music that he was there when I wrote to, to, to lift and buoy my spirits because... Uh, it was a very, very difficult time, and I know that people did that. I get those messages on social media that, that my music or, and, and other people's music really lifted them during this, this time. And you, you still struggle with, uh, with that, don't you? I do, I do. I, um, I, I'm, let's just say currently I'm still medicating with music. I, yeah. uh, just, just to, uh, because he was such a big part of my life, just a year older than me and, and, and a real partner in life. Mm -hmm. And... Uh, just to have him him gone has been yes, it's been difficult. Yeah. I'm sorry. Oh, for your I'm sorry to hear that. Your um your mum, uh, Ruth. Yes. Ruth, yes. Predicted. Yes. <laughs> she did. She did. She said. Uh, um, first of all, she's all she's in all of my lyrics. So if you like my lyrics, then you love her. Aww. She uh, her optimism. But she said, Gregory. Your talent will make room for you at the seat of royalty. And we used to laugh at her. We were like, <laughs> But now that I perform at the Royal Albert Hall in the presence of royalty, uh, she was right. She predicted Royal Albert Hall. We didn't even know w what it was or where it was. No. Really? Because you know, a hall for me was a hallway. So I was like, Royal Albert Hall? <laughs> You know, How I was like, she, what hallway am I going to be singing in? Royal Albert Hall. She said Royal Albert Hall. Out of nowhere. <laughs> out, of, out of nowhere. Well, she knew. She, she knew of it. I didn't know of it. But she said that. Did she predict, predict other stuff? Um, well, just kind of my success at music. Uh, my, my brother was a comedian and, uh, and an actor. She, she just kind of like, this is who you will be. This is who you'll be. Because I was like, I was like, Mom, I'm, I'm studying, you know, to, uh, to work for city government. She was like, yes, son, that's wonderful, that's wonderful. Don't forget about your music. And because I was, I, I, music wasn't really in my mind. I was scared of music. I Why? was like, Why? poverty, yeah. poverty, 20 years of poverty, you know. <laughs> That'd do it. <laughs> I didn't know. I just, I, I knew I could sing, but I, I didn't know the route, how to get there. Uh, uh, how should we say, talent <clears throat> and, and ambition, but like, where do I go? You know, but I found my way. It took me some years. Yeah. But I, I endured those years because of this, this, in a way, an anointing that my mother put on me. She said, son, 
Try. Don't forget, it's the best thing you do. Try. Well, oh. so, I, so I labored in that for some time. What know? was the moment that you thought she was right? Um, you know, I think, yeah, my first Grammy nomination. <laughs> my first Grammy nomination. Uh, uh, you know, being in that environment, I was like, wow. She, she said it, and, and here I am. She believed, you know, isn't it interesting how sometimes somebody can believe in you more than you believe in yourself sometimes? Yeah. yeah. That's, that's what it was. Um, both her and my brother, they, they believed in me, they championed me, they was like, my brother was like, wait till you hear my brother. Oh, oh, this dude is nice, but wait till you hear my brother. <laughs> I would never be that way, but my brother was like, you know, an you know, a, 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 a extrovert, yeah. and I was kind of a quiet introvert, and so he helped me uh, gain my confidence, and uh, so so that 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 stage charisma and and comfort that you see is something that my brother helped me with, yeah. you know, many years. So you sing years. for him. I sing for him absolutely for the rest of my life. I will. Yeah. yeah. Will you do? Will you sing for oh. him in a minute? Absolutely. Um, oh. It's been a real pleasure. A real pleasure. Thank you. I'll, 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 I want to say I'll be on tour in May. Uh, around major cities in the UK. Uh, so check that out when you get a chance. Brilliant. I'm going to come. Thank you. I'm going to come. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. Off you go and Thank get you ready. So much. And in the meantime, <laughs> I am going to hold this up again and say, um, what, a, what a guy. Uh, <laughs> uh, this is the album, Still Rising. It's available to buy now. Uh, in a, um, if, as we were saying then about the tour, if you fancy listening in person, uh, tour tickets for next year are currently on sale.